This component is the brace cleat flush. Please don't get this confused with a brace cleat, which is a, a different component. Quite similar, but different component. This component is for joining two pieces of aluminium together, end on end and a butt join. It comes with 10 in a box, and it comes again, once again, with the um, H16 screws, which there's 50 in this box, there's 16 mil long, there are hex drive and a 3 8 driver head, so this is one right here. Um, so there's 50 of those in the box, which means you've got plenty spare because you've got 10 spare because you only need 40 if you've got a, a box of 10 of those. So to join this profile together, which is the 45, you're going to need two brace cleat flushes and eight screws. So with regards to this component, it, it is a structural component but there are limitations in where you can use it. So obviously, we've got a join of these two pieces of aluminum here. Now, you cannot join, but join this joist in the middle of a span. You know, if you've got a bearer here and you've got a bearer way over here, you can't join it in the middle of the span. But what you are allowed to do is, you are allowed to join a joist within one quarter of the joist span. It also pays to note, that you can't join a joist exactly on top of a bearer. The reason being, you'll see that the brace cleat flush sits right there and it actually inhibits you from using a joist anchor. So what you can do is you can always just um, join your joists off to the side and your joist anchor will fit perfectly. So when you're using a brace cleat flush in this profile, where it's the 90 profile double channel, uh, you want to get your first brace cleat and you want to put it in the top side channel and you want to get the second one and put it in the bottom channel like so, screw it off. Um, in most applications that will suffice but if you are going to be using these brace cleat flushes to butt join a joist it's recommended that you put four of these brace cleat flushes on so one in each channel on each side. Okay so when you're using a brace cleat flush on a 135 profile which is the profile with the th three channels in the side you need two of these on each side simply put that in there screw it off screw it off slide it together and then screw off the other side there and then roll it over and do the same on the other side right so if you're going to use this brace cleat flush for the um, four channel profile which is the 180 you can see you've got, you need one of these in every single channel. So simply lie the profile on its side. You've got one of these in each channel. Slide it together. Screw them off. One screw in every hole. And then roll it over and do the other side. 